Hey there explorers, welcome to a live demo of the brand new creative mode in Core Keeper. I'm your trusty guide Vince, and I'm excited to take you through the ins and outs of this exciting new edition. To get started, simply click on Start Game, click on an empty world slot, select your world name, and your world icon. Now, instead of Standard or Hard Mode, choose the Creative option. Creative Mode and Regular Mode characters are kept separate, so if this is your first time in Creative Mode, create a fresh character and jump into your new world. Once you've entered the world, you'll find yourself in a cavernous, empty space ready for you to unleash your creativity. Open up your inventory to discover all the new options that come with Creative Mode. You'll have access to a plethora of new tools, including the ability to show UI, disable God Mode, and play the game world. God Mode is a powerful tool at your disposal, enabling you to move through objects, destroy obstacles with ease, and place objects quickly. You don't have to worry about your items being consumed or by being blocked in by environmental pieces that are in your way. Clicking the Play or Pause World button is like having your very own time machine. It allows you to freeze or unfreeze the simulation in your world, including the AI behavior of enemies and other game-related events. So take your time to perfect your creations without worrying about unexpected interruptions. The Creative Mode menu is your one-stop shop for all the items and objects you'll need to bring your world to life. Everything is sorted neatly, so you can quickly find what you need and get back to building. As you begin to place objects and items in the game world, you'll begin to notice that these objects are not consumed on being placed. Additionally, you won't be hindered by objects being in the way or by missing floor tiles as you can move through them unimpeded. There's also plenty of equipment for you to use if you'd like to use additional equipment during the creation process, such as gaining additional lighting or extra inventory space. To do this, simply go into the Creative Mode menu Collect the items you want to use, then hide the UI to get your regular Core Keeper UI back and be able to equip these items. And let's not forget about the enemies. You have the power to place them anywhere you like, allowing you to create scenarios where you can watch different enemies interact with each other in the world. But don't worry, they won't interact with anything until you click Play World. At this point, you know everything that you'll need to know to begin your creative mode journey and explore the depths of your own imagination. You can create custom scenes, experiment with enemy interactions, and bring your circuit ideas to life. And if you want to team up with your friends and create amazing worlds together, the possibilities are endless. Our goal with this new mode is to empower players to express themselves in a completely unique and imaginative way. We understand that many of you have been waiting for this opportunity to focus solely on the creative aspect of the game, and we're happy to deliver it to you today. So, get ready to dive into the underground and let your creativity run wild.